So welcome back. In this section of the tapes and in our course, we'll be exploring even more deeply the wanting security or survival. That is the deepest program that we'll be working on in this class. It underlies the wanting approval and the wanting control. And when you start to release the wanting security or survival, what you'll notice is that you just start to relax inside. You start to feel safe and at home wherever you are. The wanting security and survival is obvious if your car is skidding out of control. It may not be as obvious in how insidiously we're on God 24 hours a day lest something bad happens to us. Now the problem with that is it expends a tremendous amount of energy. Just allow your focus to start to focus on your overall feeling sense in this moment. And could you welcome however you're feeling in this moment? Could you really allow it to be here? Know that it's okay to feel the way you feel. Now think of a situation in your life where you felt threatened or challenged. where the wanting security or survival was stirred up. And could you just welcome the wanting security or survival into your awareness? Could you just allow it to be here? And then could you let it go? Now remember, there's absolutely nothing wrong with being safe, with being secure. But when we're wanting it, we feel like we lack it. We feel threatened. We feel unsafe. And that's what we're letting go of. In fact, as you release the wanting security or survival, you'll notice you feel more and more safe and secure. Now focus on that same situation or another situation in your life where you felt strong fear, where you felt threatened, where you were wanting security or survival. And could you welcome that wanting security into your awareness? Could you allow it to be here?
and then could you let it go? Invite up more of the wanting security or survival into your awareness. Think of a situation that usually makes you feel insecure, that you usually feels threatening. And just welcome it. Let yourself experience it. And realize all the ones are merely just energy. They're not good or bad, right or wrong. They just are. And could you let go of that wanting security or survival? Could you allow it to be released? Now focus on the same thing or something else that usually stirs up a little bit of wanting security or survival in your awareness or maybe even a lot. and allow yourself to welcome it into your awareness. Allow it to be here. And then could you let it go? Now again, welcome wanting security or survival into your awareness. And if you need to, you can think of a specific situation that stirred it up or some recurring thing that usually makes you feel threatened. As you release on the wanting security or survival, the things that now you find threatening will seem less and less threatening. Now let's take our exploration of wanting security or survival even deeper. Remember, the wants, wanting approval, control, and security are belief systems or programs that we operate our life from. And because of that, there are recurring patterns of thoughts, feelings, and behaviors. In wanting security, you might think Oh, it's, this is not good. Something bad is about to happen. This doesn't feel right. This is going to be a big mistake. You might feel scared or threatened or out of control or just uneasy. You might feel even terror. You might have a panic attack. You might just feel fearful. You might freeze right in the middle of an important meeting or important situation. You might fight with someone, even if there's nothing to fight about. You might overplan. You might also just run away. And you'll do whatever you can to protect yourself and to maintain the status quo. Those are just some of the things that you might do from the wanting security or survival. But what is it that you think, that you feel, that you do when you're feeling wanting security or survival? Let yourself become aware of that. And could you just welcome that into your awareness? Let it be here. And then could you let go of the wanting security or survival? Again, think of some of the recurring thoughts feelings or behaviors or actions that you take 
you think and you feel when you're feeling threatened or out of control, when you're wanting security or survival. And could you just allow that wanting security or survival to be here? And then could you allow it to be released? Could you just let it go? Again, allow yourself to think of some of the recurring thoughts and feelings and behaviors that come from the wanting security or survival program, the lie that you lack it. And just let yourself feel what it feels like to want security or survival. Could you just allow it to be here? And then could you let it go? Again, allow yourself to think of a thought that you have all the time, a feeling that you have all the time, or some actions that you take when you're wanting security or survival, when you feel like you lack it. And notice how that stirs up the wanting security or survival in this moment. And then could you allow it to be here? And then could you let it go? Take another look inside and just allow yourself to become aware of some of the thoughts, feelings, and behaviors that come from the wanting security or survival. And just welcome that wanting into your awareness. And then could you just set it free, let it go. But let yourself feel the feeling now. Feel what it feels like to want security or survival. Really explore it inwardly. And then could you allow yourself to go in awareness to the very core of wanting security or survival? Could you dive into the heart of wanting security or survival? Yes, it's possible to dive into insecurity. And when you do, you'll discover the ultimate security. And could you allow yourself to go even deeper? And deeper still. And still deeper, allow yourself to go to where wanting security and survival arises from. And just a little deeper. And if you're still aware of any wanting security or survival in this moment, 
could you just set it free? Allow it to be released. And notice how much more secure you feel in this moment after releasing just a little bit of the wanting security and survival. Imagine what your life will be like as you're more and more secure, as you let go of the sense of lacking safety and security, as you feel more at home. So I invite you to explore letting go of the wanting security or survival as you go through your life. When you notice that threatened feeling, know it can be released easily. And you can feel that security that's natural to you in any moment, no matter what's going on around you. And each time you listen to this tape, you'll get more out of it. You'll feel more and more deeply connected to the part of you that's always safe. And you'll feel that it's easier and easier to let go of the wanting security and survival.